A new Pathfinder 2e automations module has just been released. Yesterday. It's called PF2e Assistant. It's meant to auto apply effects or roll saves or even damage based on certain situations. And best of all, it's free. Let's check it out. I'm gonna have Valerius here attempt to trip the rat. And when he does so, it's automatically gonna apply the trip condition to him. And look at that. Oh my God, not only did he trip, he crit succeeded auto rolling damage. I'm gonna do the same with a grapple. Look at that, it automatically adds the grab condition on him. That's awesome. Lastly, it does critical specialization effects for swords or whatever it is automatically. Here's a level five Aleros and when I hit the critical button, it's gonna add the off guard to him. Look at that, for one round. Cool. And this is just the start of the module. There's so many features planned, but I think the module author is gonna need your help in this. For the messages he sent me, he wants people to try this out and then fill out a form to request automations that they would wanna see in their games. So do that. Install this module and start requesting. I bet you're asking yourself right now, wait, isn't there already an automations module in Foundry? Doesn't it already work okay? Let me explain why this one might just be that little bit better. Other than the fact that you need to pay for PF2E automations by going to Razor's Patreon, PF2E automations apparently has multiple hooks for the same thing, making it multiple lines of code. Every time you check an automation, it's gonna call on a hook. Apparently, from what the module authors told me, PF2E Assistant has less hooks, which means it's gonna be faster, less laggy, and work just that little bit better. Being perfectly truthful with you, literally almost a week ago, I had to uninstall Razor's module because the lag was unbearable. So this module coming out yesterday is perfect timing. The biggest thing that this module author has told me is that he's planning on making it as big as automations. It's just in a growing phase right now. It's just started, but eventually it's gonna be just as massive in terms of scope. And finally, I've been told there's a couple of extra cool features like hero point re-rolling actually working. So if you roll a failure into a success, it actually does the grapple thing. Also, maybe something based on reactions used and whatnot. So that, that way you don't have to track reactions. Hmm. Stay tuned for more features in this module and get it right now and help the module author out. That's all for today. Like and subscribe. Bye.